Hi guys, it's me, Ashlyn, and today, well, I'm not really checking out a slime shop. I am part of the slime shop. Um, just gonna grab this. And, um, if I don't like, if I think it needs activator, or if I think it's overactivated, then my friend, who is also part of the slime shop, will work on it. But if I think it's good, then we will make more. Because these ones are just for testing. So, let's get on with the video. Let's go. Okay, so we're going to be starting off with this slime. Okay, at first. Okay, now, this feels overactivated. Kind of. So I think it could add some lotion. Baby lotion. Okay, so it's lotion it's working it's magic if you add the lotion and immediately start stretching it that's how you do it that's i think that the slime learns to stretch and then it just always does that until it becomes hard or something still feels a little bit overactivated, even though it does stretch and stuff so i think i want to add a little more lotion go also it protects your hands from all the lotion or not because usually it just keeps the lotion inside and then takes slime in mixes it in okay so this feels good so this is how i'd like it um this is better than before before it felt overactivated and it felt like it was just going to be a fail, but now. It is. Sorry for that. My mom's just putting away garbage. Um, it's a good sign. So let's get on to the next one. Okay, I touched this one and it's sticky. So I have this one in this container because I ran out of containers, so I'm just going to add some activator. Yep, the activator's dissolved. Here we go. Okay, I'll be back when it's all ready. Hey guys, don't mind all the slime on my hands. It was really sticky. And it still kind of is. Not too much, though. And it does. It's got a really good texture. It's got, um, let me see, let me see here. Little cereal pieces. Not real, don't worry. See the little Cheerios. Got slime in the middle. They're just floating, bobbing around in the slime. This slime is very, very runny. It, it's very thick, too. But it's still a little bit sticky, but I've got extra activator just in case. Let's see right here. Might need some here. One, two, three. Come on. Oh. 
also later, um, after I'm all ready, I'm going to be making a tutorial on how to make your own scrub. So, yeah. Okay, so, overall, I think that you should activate this slime a little bit more, but I think so far, it's really good. I think it's just because of the shipping, because she actually shipped it to me to mimic an actual package. So, I think it's because of the packaging. Got a little sticky. So let's get on to the next slime. Okay, now I've got an actual container for this one. It has blown beads in it, and I think it's the container's a little bit cracked. It's fine. It is a butter slime with flown beads. Here, I'm just gonna get this extra slime off my hands. I'll be right back when all it's off my hands. Okay, so the next one is this. It was a little hard. It is a butter slime with some flown beads and glitter. Um, <clears throat> no, no, no. this is actually part of our approval packaging. If you don't, if you do not know what approval packaging is, um, I'll tell you now. And if you still don't get it, I'm going to explain it in the um, description. It is where you have, if you want special packaging for like Christmas or something, or you just want special packaging for like a gift. So spe like normal special packaging just for gift for like you did a really good test and you did really well and you got like a good scholarship for a good college or something that's a special packaging it's not for a holiday but you still get a good package like it's going to be wrapped but if it's for christmas or something or a birthday you have to tell us and we'll wrap it in either birthday christmas or easter wrappings those are the three that we do and and Valentine's Day. So that's what the approval packaging is. We're gonna explain more in the description. So this one is part of the approval one, but I didn't pack it. She didn't pack it because um we didn't want to and we didn't want to waste wrapping paper. So it also comes with three bows, so you could pick which bow you want to put on the thing and then it comes with your own little label and then you you just have to write your name and who it's to and then give it to them for the holiday or something and yeah so that's what the approval packaging is we're going to explain more in the description and yeah i think we're going to get on to the next slide okay so this one is also part of the approval packaging um, it's a jiggly slime. It's a little bit overactivated, but it's a jiggly slime. And I have, it's really good. So I haven't made more yet. Well, she hasn't made more yet. Well, not she. I made this one. I think it's really good. It's just a little overactivated and hard because we had it out. We played with it for a lot. And I guess it got a little hard. And it's not like me and my sister doing this. No, it's me and my friend. Or my brother or something. No, it's only my me and my friend. Um, it's only the two of us. Also, on my... Our... It's only me and one other friend. And we also have a YouTube channel together. Go check it out. I'm going to leave... The name of it in the description because I don't know how to leave links. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, so it's starting to come together now. Okay, I think it made it more overactivated. Uh oh.
Oh, this was such a good slime. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's because all this activator over here, I spilled it. Okay. I'm gonna add some more of this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Like I said, do this. Do it early on while you're fixing it, and it'll do that for the rest of the time while it's still good. Unless it has like activator in it. I mean, if it's overactivated, then you probably can't. It'll just rip, but. Yeah, this is not working <laughs> at all. So I'm going to give the slime a rating of my own. I'm not going to give it a good rating because I made it. <laughs> no. I'm going to give it a rating on how I think it is. I'm going to say it's 4 out of 10. No, 5 out of 10. Because it's pretty purple. Great pokes. It's glossy. That's three things. It kind of stretches, has glitter in it, and has flow me, so, wait, what? I think that's six things, so six out of ten. But it doesn't stretch. Oh, yeah, it's starting to stretch. Okay, I really like this slime now. So, yeah, let's get on to the next slime. Have you got okay, so, this is, um... Kind of a big slime. And it is a butter slime. Well, no, it was a fluffy slime, and then my friend put. It's not a butter slime. It feels like a butter slime, though. It spreads like a butter slime. I'm not going to spread it because it's not a butter slime. That would be cringy, but it feels like a butter slime. There's no clay in it, it's just glue. A Bunch of shaving cream, baby oil, and I think, oh yeah, color. So what happened, I had a really weird fluffy slime, and then I added a really sticky dark blue slime, and the slime, the original slime was, oh, also it has foam beads and glitter, and it was originally really light, and now it's turning kind of darker. So. Darker, Parker! Hey. So, I'm going to give this a rating of, let's say, 10 out of 10. Also, um, my slime shop, my friend's slime shop, Slimy Drawer, which I am becoming a part of, but I'm not part of yet, is actually sponsoring me for this video. That's the one that I'm about to be part of. So, these are the slimes I made for it. Originally, it was just her, my friend, Paige. You know her from our to YouTube channels, her YouTube channel, my YouTube channel, she sometimes comes on mine and I sometimes go on hers, and then we have one big channel together, and this is on my channel, so I think this is going to be wrapping up the video, um, I'm going to play with this one a little bit more, just at the 15 minute mark, and yeah, so we still got 30 seconds to go. So that's half a minute. And this slime is super good. It has foam beads. It has glitter. It's so good. So always be cautious. Get a pet dog. And never forget to brush your teeth.